Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Supercharge your teamwork. In this video, you will discover how to link Trello with Microsoft Teams for enhanced collaboration and productivity. So guys, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you can have the full experience. So, first of all, make sure that you are on Trello. Go and open one of your workspaces and within the workspace normally you will find your boards. If you don't have one, you simply have to click on create a new board from here or here. Then choose create board, give it a title and click on create. So let me open one of my boards. So let me just click on this one. And here I am. Now to add Microsoft Teams into Trello, we are going to use something called Power Up. Power Up and Trello are just like plugins in WordPress, extensions in uh, maybe Squarespace, and basically apps in Shopify and etc. So let's search for Power Ups. To find them, you will normally have something not like that. Um, let me just open a new board. So it will be something just like this. And it will be the word Power Up, just like so. For those who have already power ups, the power up icon will be smaller and it will be shrinked just like that. Click on it and basically click on add power ups. I have already some other power ups here, so just ignore them and just click here. The next thing to do is to search for Microsoft Teams. And as you can see, here it is. Let's click on configure or basically just click on it. So what is the Microsoft Teams integration? This is something that I highly recommend in every single video, which is reading the page of the power up. That is very important. So you can understand exactly what the functionalities and the features within the power up that you are going to download or to add. So in order you can understand if it has the outcome that you really want. So let's go through it. The Trello for Microsoft Teams integration helps you link your Trello Teams to those in Microsoft Teams. This will enable you to receive Trello notifications in Microsoft Teams, view your Trello board in Microsoft Teams, and much more. With the Microsoft Teams integration, you can see all of the Trello right within Microsoft Teams. It's like that. As you can see, this is, by the way, the app of Microsoft Teams. This is not Trello. But the read general, after you click on it, you will be facing an looking at your whole board within Trello like within Microsoft Teams you can view the whole board in Trello now how to set up the Trello in Microsoft Teams well first of all you have to click the configure button at the top of the page which is basically the page on Microsoft Teams not on Trello and this will open up the Trello listing in the Microsoft Teams Marketplace where you can configure the integration between Trello and Microsoft Teams. So first thing, you have to click on this configure button. Then, install the Trello in Microsoft Teams. So they will take you here and you have to click on get it now. Now, after you do that, once you have installed the Trello in Microsoft Teams, you can interact with Trello in a number of different ways without leaving Microsoft Teams. Trello boards as tabs in Microsoft Teams. So this is something that you will have to see. So here, as you can see, these are the boards. And basically here they are explaining to you exactly how it works. Additionally, you can add your boards to any of your channels as a permanent tab. Tabs provide dedicated canvas to see your team's Trello boards, lists, and cards. To add a Trello tab to a channel, select the channel, then click on the plus sign to the right of the existing tab. In the pop-up, select Trello from the list of apps, then click Log in with Trello. In the next pop-up, enter your credentials and click Accept. So you can get into your account, so you have to put your credentials and basically accept the permissions that you will provide. Then once you do that, you can select the Trello board you would like to link to. Trello will create a new tab named after the board and the tab will contain the lists and cards for that specific board. Inside the tab, you can now interact with the board in the same way you would have you logged in directly to Trello.com. So this board 
you literally can use it as if you were in Trello. You can move it, delete stuff, uh, delete stuff, uh, move stuff, add stuff, um, assign people, delete people. Like yeah, it's just simply like an some a small app of Trello within Microsoft Teams where you can manage literally everything. So th this is this is very 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 nice. So here note, you must be a member of a board to add it to your team application. Team visible boards will not show as an option until you join the board. And you can edit cards the way you would in Trello. All actions will automatically be synchronized with Trello. So this is exactly the application that we have. Now here there is like the features and benefits and why choose Trello for Microsoft Teams. Here let's read this as well. So features and benefits. Visualize with ease. Gain instant access to your Trello boards, lists, cards, right within Microsoft Teams. You can streamline tasks. Seamlessly create new cards and effortlessly move existing ones between lists in Trello. You can meet deadlines, so you can set due dates or mark cards as complete directly from your Microsoft Teams environment. Team integration. Add your Trello board as dedicated tab in your team channel, ensuring Swift team access and collaboration. Effortless search. You can rapidly search for Trello cards using keywords and seamlessly share card information in conversations. Onboarding support. Discover a comprehensive quick to start tour or tour within the app, ensuring a smooth onboarding experience. Now there is some couple of things that are new. For example, you can stay connected. You can view your Trello boards and cards conventionally, conveniently in the personal static tab of Microsoft 365 and Outlook. Efficient sharing. Search for cards and effortlessly share them via email and Microsoft Outlook. And Microsoft Copy Lots. Retrieve and view Trello cards using Microsoft Copy Lots. Simply start by saying fetch my pending cards to next day. So these are things that are basically available with Trello. Here's some pictures. Let me just look at them. As you can see, they look pretty good. Um, they are smooth and everything is going to be very much easier to interact with your team. So for example, there is a specific task or something that you would like to talk about. You can simply mention it. You can literally just mention it within the chat. Hey guys, what about this? When are you going to finish it? It's very important in the priority and the due date is coming up soon. So this is something that you could use it for. And yeah guys, that was it for today's video. Thank you guys all for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial.